Are we rolling? Yes. Okay. <laughs> That's why I did this. Hi. <laughs> Welcome back to Singer Family Adventures, the Castaway Key, Castaway Key Edition. Um, we had an amazing day today. I had an amazing day. I don't know if my kids had an amazing day, but I think they did have a good day. Um, we've been having technical problems with the GoPro, which stinks because my hopes of vlogging were like out the window. Um, which by the way, in a minute, you've got to see our window cause it's fabulous. Jonah's actually sitting in it right now. So, so, okay. Um, we went to Castaway at 8.30, like as soon as we could get off the ship. We got chairs, we got floaties. I'm the only one who rented snorkel gear because my kids don't like to snorkel and I think it is the funnest thing in the world. I don't like to see fish. What's wrong with fish? They're slimy. They're slimy. Fish are slimy. Okay, so anyway, we all got the floaties and we just floated around and had a good old time and then the teenagers disappeared and did, I don't know what, they're teenagers. Um, I think my son's girlfriend took a nap in a hammock or something. Yeah, okay, so, you know, good island activities. Then we had a lovely lunch and then all the kids wanted to go back on the ship and I'm like, I'm staying. So I stayed. Um, I did a teeny bit of shopping. I bought this shirt that matches my tattoo with hibiscus on it. Um, I'm going to have a shopping haul video that will probably come out before this one. But then I went snorkeling again. I'd gone snorkeling in the morning for a little bit. Um, this time I was like, I'm going all the way out. I want to see what there is. I've been snorkeling at Castaway. I think this is my fourth time. Last time was right after Hurricane Dorian and you really couldn't see anything. Um, so this time I went all the way deep into the little snorkeling lagoon. It was amazing. So fish, fish, fish. They've got all this stuff like buried in the sand under the water. Um, these sort of like cast iron rotting things that look like they came off of submarines with fish darting in and out of them. And guess what we found? What did we find? A dirty chip bag. Oh, we found this chip bag while we were swimming, while we were floating around. And it was just a Lay's yellow chip bag. I picked it up with my feet. And it smelled, and it looked all It, ugh, it was full of rotting seaweed, and it smelled like the worst sewage rot smell ever. Anyway, I, I, I went and threw it away on the beach. But, um, Please, someone pick it up. It's disgusting. Anyway... Can I get back to my snorkeling adventures? Yes. See, now I'm forgetting what order I did everything in. So I swim out, I swim out, I swim out. And at one point, there is a 20 foot long submarine that I believe is from the, like, what was it? How many thousand leagues under the sea was that ride? That movie? It's an old Disney. It was from Disneyland and it got shut down. Anyway, there's a full size submarine. I mean, it's like. It's at least 20 feet long, 30 feet long. And then I finally found the Mickey statue. Um, there's a buried Mickey statue and he's sitting there and it, it's just super cool. And so I touched his, his hand with my toe and I was like, yes, I saw the Mickey statue. And then I turn around and there is uh, this like, a, what looks like another statue over in that direction. So I swim towards it. And I get closer and I'm like, there's fish surrounding that statue. And I, so I start slow, swimming really slowly so I don't disturb the fish. I get there, it was at least, it was at least a hundred silver fish, like this long. And it wasn't a statue, it was the silver fish. Like all calmed in together in a little school, like resting. And then eventually they started floating and then eventually they started swimming away. It was the biggest school of fish I'd ever seen. Super cool. And then I'm looking at that and this thing comes under me. I saw, guys, Rafi, I saw an eel. I saw a, a like six foot long bright green eel. It must have been this big around and it was like it was like six feet long, this big around. How on earth did you see an eel? I was way out in the deep part and there were all these um, like structures underground that fish were swimming in and out of and this eel just comes out and the eel's swimming along and 
I was there and there was a father and a son and, and we're all like up on the top and the eel's just like five feet below us, just swimming right under us, doesn't care. Ah, and he's going. sounds scary. It was a little scary. He was so wild and creepy looking. It was awesome. Like, it really felt like, I don't know, it just, I felt like I was in an aquarium, like, or in the wild. Did that just ring on its own? Yeah. Don't worry about it. Okay, so anyway. So the eel. I feel like I'm forgetting some. Oh, there was a stingray. There's a stingray that just swam Wait, by me. Wait, you saw an eel and a stingray? I, I'm not even done. I saw an eel and a stingray. The stingray was like this big. So that goes by. And that was actually before I got to the Mickey statue. So first was the stingray. Then was the Mickey statue. Then was the school of fish. Then was the amazing eel. Then I go up and I'm like... That was the coolest thing. And there's the dad and the boy. And they're like, oh, there's a turtle over that way just munching on grass. Go see the turtle. So I start swimming in that direction. And very soon I come across this turtle on the bottom. And the turtle's like this big around. It's like, you know, um, it's big. It's probably uh, three feet in diameter. And it was just eating grass. And I just floated right over it and I'm watching it. It was the coolest thing. And then it looks up at me and then it swims and it swims up to the top for breath of air. And then it swims back down and then it swims up for breath of air. And then for a while it decides it's going to just go near the top and poke up for air. And I like swam up with it and put my head out of the water and then went, put my head back down. I literally could have reached out and touched it. it like that's how close it was to me. And I was swimming right next to it for several minutes. It was so cool. So you saw a turtle, a stingray. I swam and with eel. the turtle. The stingray, the eel. Yeah, the turtle was just the coolest thing. And and then I was like, yes. <coughs> I saw a buried tugboat, which was like ten feet long. And then I go, um, so then at that point I've been swimming and swimming and swimming. And I come up and there's like three different outposts of um, lifeguards way out there. And so I asked one of the lifeguards, I'm like, I heard there might be a mini statue too, is there? He said, yeah, it's way over there, that white buoy. So they actually put buoys when um, when you want to go uh, scuba diving. Nobody tells you this, but there's buoys above some of the bigger things. Um, so if you see a buoy, swim up to it, look down, and that's how I found the submarine, and that's how I found the Mickey statue. And then, um, but then there's also areas where there is no buoy and there's just lots of buried stuff. And that's where I saw the eel. And, uh, so I swim over, I saw Minnie. Minnie was awesome. She was like on this purple pedestal with like yellow flowers or something. She, it, it almost looked like a buried giant Jim Shore. Okay. That's what it looked like with all the little swirly, you know, designs. And she's lying on her side with her hand on her hip going like this in her little red dress. And so she was in a more shallow area. So I, I gave her a high five underwater and then I swam back. I must have swam like two miles worth of swimming. Like, and I don't use slippers when I do snorkeling. Okay. So here's a little tip that I just learned today. I wish I'd known could have saved me money. Um, I don't like to, I'm a strong swimmer actually, as out of shape and everything as I am. I'm a good swimmer. So, and I, but I've never liked fins, like the, the flippers, they just feel really uncomfortable. So I don't use the flippers. Well, I reserved my snorkel ahead of time, but when I went to pick it up and I told the guy, oh, I don't want the flippers. He said, oh, you reserved it ahead of time. If you just walk up on Castaway the day of and say, I want the snorkel gear, but I don't want flippers, then it's half price. So I didn't know that. Oh, well. Um, oh, you know what else will happen on the beach? What? A couple got married. Oh, yeah. A couple got married today. Rafi saw it. I missed it. I saw their after photos. That was kind of fun. And I think their mom is in my, I think the groom's mom is in our fish extender group. So um, she's Whoa. getting some gifts from us tonight. And then, yeah, it was just like the best snorkeling. It even beats the snorkeling that my best other snorkeling experience in Praia de Foch in Brazil. But this was amazing. So go all the way out if you really want to see the cool snorkeling stuff at Castaway. 
it is super worth it. It was super fun. And that's all I have for you right now. I'm sorry. I was saw a guy with a GoPro, like, filming some stuff. And I said, hey, go over there to that turtle. But, um, oh, and a lobster. Lobster! Would you be my lobster? He's my lobster. I don't have a lobster. But, um... Did you actually see a lobster? I did. So I was coming back at the very end, and I'm, like, near where you can almost walk your way out. I'd, I'd taken off my mask because I'd been... You know, that mask gets uncomfortable. I'd been out there for an hour and a half easy and so I had my mask off and this woman says to her husband or boyfriend or whatever she's like oh there's a lobster I'm like oh where she said right here I said all right that's worth putting my mask on so there's you know this gray lobster that's he's this long and then his antennas were like this long and he's like ah, 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 ah. lobsters and octopi octopuses not they're just the weirdest creatures I swear they're really weird but the turtle just totally made my day. And the eel was the weirdest thing I'd ever been, like, that close to in nature. So you saw a, t a turtle, a, a stingray, a turtle, an eel, an and eel, a lobster. And a lobster and a whole lot of fish. Oh, my God. Over and out. Bye! Wait, no.